So I just saw this question on threads and it says, how are we going to use fifth grade level math to find the area of this triangle? And we have three squares and we are trying to find the area of the shaded triangle. Hmm. Then this is supposed to be a fifth grade question in Taiwan. Let's have a look. So we know that this right here is 10 centimeters and this is 5 centimeters and this is 30 centimeters and here is the triangle. Well, if you want to find the area of a triangle, you definitely have to use half base times height. If we take this to be the base of the triangle, then the height will be, well, you have to draw the perpendicular, so this right here will be the height. You can extend it, and because it's a square, so this is 90 degrees, so take that to be the height. Okay, if we can find out this and that, we are done. But how? Well, we must utilize 10 and 5 somehow, right? And this is how you can possibly do it. By the way, if you haven't paused the video and try it, you should definitely do so because the solution that I have is pretty cool. Ready? All right, so no algebra, no nothing, just the squares. Okay, here we have the big square in the middle and we know this is 10. Well, this is a small square, so that means we know that this is the same as that for sure, right? Good. Now, is it possible for us to duplicate the middle square? Yes. We have this side right here already. Well, what if we put the 10 down here? So let me just extend that. This is 10 centimeters. And I'm just going to complete the square right here. And this and that are the same. Again, this and that are equal because they are squares. We are going to do the same thing for the right hand side here. This is five. I'm just going to extend five more right here and we are going to have a square. And again, this, it's the same as that. Perhaps let me put on three lines just like the ID dot sign. But anyways, now, how are we going to figure out this all? This is 10, this is 30, right? From here to here is 30 and this is five. So all we have to do is what? 10 plus 30 plus 5 and we have three same size squares just go ahead and divide by 3 and that will give us 45 divided by 3 which is 15 so that means each part is 15 that's 15 the middle is 15 and this right here is also 15 okay to figure out this from here to here is 15 this is 10 already so here must be 5 to figure out this well, this middle part is 15. Good, so the base is 15 plus 5. So base. So that's 20 for the triangle. Now, from here to here is 15. This is 5, so this right here will be 10. So that means this will also be 10. So the triangle has the height being 10. Here we go. To find the area of this red triangle, let me just put this down like so. Area of the triangle, something like this. It's just going to be half base times height. Work that out, we get 100. And the unit is centimeters, so I'll put on cm squares for square centimeters. Just like this.